Hi everyone, this is Andrew Tyron. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to show you how to pair a Bluetooth controller to Parallels on the M1 Apple Silicon Mac running Windows 11 ARM. When we're running Parallels through here, what we need to make sure is that we have a certain setting turned on. So if we go to our control center, if we've got Windows 11 ARM installed, we can go to the USB Bluetooth settings here and make sure that we can share Bluetooth devices with Windows. So this allows us to pair a Bluetooth controller and for it to be seen in Windows. So if you don't have Windows 11 ARM installed already, then you can follow a link in the description for a tutorial on how to install Windows 11 ARM and get Windows gaming on your M1 Apple Silicon Mac. So I'm going to tap into Windows here and then what we're going to do is close this, go to the start menu and then type in the word Bluetooth. So I'm going to view my devices and see what we have installed. So what I'm doing here now is I've turned on my Bluetooth controller and I'm going to hold down the pair button. So this is my Xbox One wireless controller. I'm just letting that go into pairing mode. And then on the computer itself, we're going to press add device. Add Bluetooth device. And then we can see that this input is coming up. That's our Xbox One controller. And so this is still flashing. So once that's connected, the white light will be solid and then you have a connected controller. You can test this by going to the gamepad-tester.com website as soon as you press a button or move a joystick, then the Xbox controller will be detected. This should, in theory, work with any Bluetooth controller as well, and it should be picked up by any game that you attach, whether it's Steam or Epic Game Store. Anything that supports these, anything that supports the standard control method, should work correctly. Anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.